So question says temperature of the system remains constant, keeping the temperature constant. So I have to keep the temperature constant. So temperature is constant. So how will we use this idea? Now the question also says first reaction is a exothermic reaction and the second reaction is a endothermic reaction. Now we have to calculate what is the mole percentage of oxygen and what is the mole percentage of H2O in the mixture. So let us say mole percentage of oxygen is X. So if I know mole percentage of oxygen is X, mole percentage of O2, let us say this is equals to X. So x mole of oxygen I have. So x is the mole of oxygen. And I will have mole percentage of H2O. Let us say this is 100 minus x mole. So this is 100 minus x mole I will have. So total heat release. So if you see the first reaction, per mole of oxygen, per half mole of oxygen heat release is minus 1 1 kilo joule, 1 1 0 kilo joule. So per x mole, what is the heat required, heat released? So heat released is minus 1 1 0 into 2 into x kilo joule. So this is the heat released. Now what is the heat gained in the second equation? That is the per mole of H2O, that is 132 into 100 minus x. Now the total heat released is equal to total heat gained. So this means this is equal to 0. So I will have minus 2 to 0 x plus 1 3 2 double 0 minus 1 3 2 x is equal to 0. So we can solve for x. So 1 3 2 double 0 this is equals to 253x. So what is x? 13200. And this divided by 352. So if I use the calculator, so I will have 13200. And this divided by 352. So this value is 37.5%. So this is around 37.5%. So mole percentage of oxygen is, so percentage, this is X is O2. So this is the mole percentage of oxygen. This is equals to 37.5%. So what is the mole percentage of H2? 100 minus 37.5. So this is around, so 100 minus, so 100 minus. 100 minus 37.5 so this value is 62.5 percent so this is 62.5 percent 